Well, hello, friends. My name's Antonio, and welcome to Back at the Ranch. Our one brought his boat again, so I'm I'm excited to get out there because it's a perfect time for black drum, and uh, we got the 360 cam today, so you get to see all around us today. So that's gonna be the only camera running. It'll be watching the front. It'll be watching the back, and who knows? We might even go on a tiny planet mode just so you can see the cool views that this camera can do. So we're in the ship channel right now, uh, next to Long Island Village here, Port Isabel on this side, Long Island Village on this side. Uh, no wake zone, so we've got to go slow. But once we're out of here, we're going to be hitting it hard and going to South Bay as usual. That's my favorite place to fish. So we'll see you in a few minutes once we get to South Bay. Thanks for hanging out. to our spot first cast let's see how long we need to wait for the first bite Are nothing but kitties. Oh, you got a croaker. Another croaky. That's better than kitties. We've been catching kitty <laughs> kitties. <laughs> and a lot of sun and heat. It's hot, man. All right. I was just telling him we should move, and he just got slammed. Whitey. Oh, big whitey. Little slam. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's see that one for the camera. That's a red, dude. What's a red? No wonder. Is that a whitey? No, the camera doesn't get to see it. Oh well. You don't get Sorry. to see it, guys. <laughs> <laughs> He's not here to make videos. He's here to fish. <laughs> that big but it's big. Bigger than the catfish we were catching. It's a red. It's a red? You called it. Hold it. Did oh, it to like a fun, fun drop off? Yeah, it's a little drop off over there. It's a little short but, but it's a red. It's a red. A red's a red. I, I'll show mine to the camera. Ramon, Ramon doesn't like showing his little ones to the camera. <laughs> I would have showed, you know, one that size to the camera. Yeah, yours is about what, half the size of this one? Yeah. All right. Okay, People were going to see one. There we go. He's about, I don't know, 15, 20? Where's my, I have a measuring. Let's see. He's about pan size. Sixteen and a quarter. He gets to live another day. Slimy, slimy, slimy. All right, I'm gonna keep cats into the shallows because black drum aren't hitting. Red drum seem to like the shrimp. So let's see if we can get ourselves a nice twenty incher. All right, we changed spots. Came to we look for reds. Be though that the clouds rolled in. Uh, looks like we might be getting some rain, but I'll take raining clouds over hot sun and no wind any day. How about you, Ramon? I sure do. 
will. I sure do will. I, I See, sure the, do will. <laughs> the, the sun has us all messed up already. Yeah. I can't even. I can't even speak straight. <laughs> I speak crooked. I sure will. I sure will. Happy I do. So we were gonna go to real shallow water. We saw a lot of reds out there, but now it's a oh, 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 oh. look at that. Not big, but I got it. It's gonna be a catfish with my love. Well, not a catfish. It's a croaker. Gonna use him for bait now? I think so. I think it's time to cut up a croaker. So we got on the water about 8.30 this morning. It's currently 10 o'clock on the dot, actually, like 10.01. Man, it was really hot this morning. Uh, still hot, humid, no wind at all, which is great for the microphones, but bad for us. But as you can see, we have a nice big cloud coming in. It's kind of cooled us down a bit. We got some rain coming in, light drizzle right now on us. I wouldn't mind getting a little wet, but I don't want to get drenched. So <laughs> you're getting a bump on that white one. A little tap, little tap. It'll tap tap. It'll tap tap. Come on, take, take it. There, there, there you go. go. I think that's a small croaker. The way it bent. <clears throat> We're gonna throw a popping cork with the shrimp. Yeah. Doa. The old faithful doa. Yeah. Got that one on. Mm -hmm. Nada. Did you put fish on that one or shrimp? Uh, fish. Oh, maybe I need some fish. Uh, if it's the piece of croaker, they'll keep tapping on that. So Ramon, since we're uh, kind of fishing, sitting and waiting, why don't you tell me about that hog, that last hunt that we got? I know you took most of it home. Your mom and dad came over and you guys prepared it. Why don't you let everybody know how you prepared it and if you've got those photos, send them to me so I can show everybody how you set it up weeks ago maybe a month ago we went we it's went been, out to yeah it's been about a month yeah we went out to my boss's ranch yeah to try to shoot a couple of uh little hogs that were coming out to the feeder man they were good they had a very very nice small barbecue pit size barbecue pit size hogs and so you know it although it turned out to be a good hunt uh, I didn't get to shoot because well you you guys will see that later on you can click on the link it's already click posted and, and see what happened <laughs> <laughs> nonetheless um, so I got I was lucky enough to take most part of the little hog home and uh, my mom went over and I had previously like a week before I told my mom that that I wanted some uh, asado de puerco that's uh, pork. It's like a stew almost. Pork stew but almost. It yeah. Made made a little different. Very and, different. And and so yeah, my mom went out there. Uh, it was hot as heck, as you will see in some of the videos. We were sweating, but it oh, you turned. Have, you have videos too. Yeah, I have oh, videos. Nice. It nice. turned it turned out pretty good. So um, so we so we did the pork stew, and then we did some rice, and some uh, charro beans. And if you haven't tried the charro beans, man, the recipe will be available soon. But <laughs> man, those those charro beans with Mexican rice, amazing. You guys put a lot of chili, jalapeno, serrano, we, made it spicy. Yeah, we made it spicy. Um, we used a lot of different spices that, you know, recipes that my, that my mom uh, learned when she was younger and her mom taught them to her and so you know uh, it's recipes that are being passed on generation by generation and so i think the real question is have you learned the recipe i am learning <laughs> you know my mom out of all my my brothers and sisters were seven um i'm the only one that loves to cook so, so you know what i think that means everybody is we need to go get another hog and we need to get him to cook for us on yes, video live so definitely if you yeah. guys want that comment below let me know what you think 
in the meantime let me throw in the videos and the uh, photos that he's gonna send me uh, so you guys can check out that awesome meal because I want to oh get in a bite oh getting Mario. another bite oh that's uh, uh lady. lady I saw it jump or I heard it jump or I think it's loose already. Yeah, it's loose. All right. Uh, getting a, oh, Ramon, you're on, you're on. Getting a nibble on this one. My line got loose too. Mine <coughs> uh, was a little one. You're on? Yeah, you're on. Sounds good. Yep. Put a little bit of that drag. It is good. I'll get some in. Is that on the fish? Mm -hmm. Woo! You want me to pull my line out? Yeah, take it out, take it out, take it out. Running around us, I'll take my other vine out. He's uh, actually, no, he's already coming straight at us. Right here. Net, 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 net. Ooh, he saw the boat. That's dinner. <laughs> nice job, buddy. <laughs> nice. Did you measure him yet? He measures 23. 23. 23 and a quarter. Ramon's hooked up again. That's a bigger one, I think. Is that on the ladyfish? Yep. Nice. <laughs> Alright, almost 12 in the afternoon. South Bay is really not producing for us today, but we're gonna give uh, one more spot a shot, and if nothing happens, I think we're going to clean the red. What do you think? Yes, sir. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna head out actually where this other boat's at right in front of us. Off to the left, you'll see like four PVC pipes sticking out of the out of the water. Kind of the the marker to the to the two channels that are out here. So we've had good luck out there with black drum before. Because they're not here. Red stop hitting, it's just that one. So let's see if we can find those black drum. Croaker. Croaker. So he's got a whiting and a croaker and a catfish so far in this spot. And uh we just set a, a limit for ourselves and we catch one more catfish. We caught in a quits. I haven't had a single bite here yet. So comment below, let me know what you think about the new camera. How does it look? Do you like the panning? Do you like the zoomed out fisheye look? Do you prefer the old view where you're just seeing one way and one way only? Cause I kind of like this camera. I like the way it looks, I like the way it edits, which is really what matters, but you guys are the ones watching it, right? And I want you guys to watch. So so let me know, what style do you like? Do you like the 360 style or you prefer the straight action cam style? No bites. Got the 
catfish. Not a catfish, so that means we keep fishing. Another croaker. <clears throat> You're in the croaker hole on that side. All right, I'm finally hooked up in this spot and it doesn't feel too good. I have a feeling we're about to go back. Let's see. Oh, another croaker, <laughs> not a catfish. That means we keep fishing. You gotta set yourself some boundaries and rules, man. Otherwise uh, you fish all day. You know, the funny thing is we've been catching catfish most of the day. And now that I set the rule of if we catch a catfish, we leave. Now we're not catching catfish. So. Maybe we should set that rule all the time. <laughs> <clears throat> We're almost done with our bait too. This is a one box of bait, which he's gonna save the second box to go fishing with my brother later. Come on. Look at that, they're all tangled up. So my brother will be in town in the next hour, uh, but I have my wife and my daughters at the RV, so I'm gonna be heading back here shortly to hang out with them because my daughter's down, my older daughter's down from Austin. And uh, she wants to hang out, go to the pool, and possibly go fishing on the jetties later tonight. So maybe we get another video today fishing the jetties. All right, so we did not catch another catfish, but we also have not caught anything in the last 15 minutes. Not even a perch, or croaker, or anything. I think we're gonna call it quits. Head back, clean that nice red that Ramon got. Have ourselves a beer. It's almost noon. And she lighted the AC. <laughs> so really appreciate you guys uh, hanging out. Wasn't very action packed today, but we'll see you next time. I'm back at the ranch. <laughs>